Welcome to another video tutorial brought to you by the technical support team at Futech Advanced Sensor Technology. Today, we will show you how to use the LSB200 tool to properly and safely install attachments to your LSB200 load cell. The purpose of this tool is to ensure that there are no unintended forces applied to the load cell while attaching accessories. These extraneous forces, such as torque and off-axis loads, can damage the load cell if they are too strong. It is important to note that the LSB200 and many other FUTAC load cells have a designated loading surface. This is specified in the sensor spec sheet. It is also important to monitor the load cell's readings during the installation process to see if we are applying any unintended loads. We can do this using an IPM650. It is important to have enough slack on the sensor cable so the tension on the cable does not accidentally shift the sensor's position, influencing the readings and possibly damaging internal connections. Now we will attach a hook to the loading surface of our LSB200. I have already attached a flat loading disc to the bottom surface for added stability. Slide the tool into the sensor so that the loading surface perfectly fills the gap in the tool. There should be no room for the sensor to move. Next, screw in the attachment while keeping the tool and sensor still. Try not to press down on the sensor too hard while screwing in the attachment. Also, avoid screwing in the attachment too tightly as this can create harmful torque. Next, we will use a lock nut to fasten this bolt to our sensor. First, screw in the attachment, then tighten the nut, all while keeping the sensor in place with the installation tool. You can use an adjustable wrench to tighten the nut as necessary. This video has been brought to you by the technical support team at Futech Advanced Sensor Technology. Thanks for watching.